One ball, two strikes. Also walked twice early in the game. Pitch is slapped right side by the first baseman into right field. Runner coming around third. Here comes Dalton Lynn to the dish. He's going to score standing. And here's a throw down to second base. And they got a chance for an out. Safe there. Runner coming home. But now Deloach will scoop back and slide into third base. And he is safe. So runners on second and third. Musselman comes through with the RBI hit to the backside. Two outs, runner at third. Dogs up 7 nothing. Bottom half of the fourth. And the pitch. Hit in the air to right field. Stewart coming in. It bounces in for a base hit. And touching home is Foster Jones. So Musselman with two big hits. Two runs batted in. The dogs have eight. One, two. Call strike three on the outside edge. So a K for Musselman, his 16th of the season. Swings and hits it over toward the second baseman, Patel. He goes to Anita, scoop it, and throws to first close play, and he's safe. And Musselman has beat out another infield hit. Swing and a miss. The ball's in the dirt. Cole Graham throws it down to Miller. And two down and a third strikeout for Chase Musselman. Two and two on Musselman, a right-handed hitter. And the pitch. He chops it, could be a tough play. Landed Thompson, the third baseman, throws to first and safe. Musselman takes a tumble. And is everybody okay? Yep. Two strike pitch on the way. Swings, lines it into center field for an RBI hit. And here comes Bryce Deloach. He comes home and the Bulldogs lead five zip. Third base, he's 0 for two with a fly ball to left and a fly ball to center. And down to the count, nothing and one. Righty versus righty, second pitch. And he drops in an off-speed pitch for a strike, nothing and two. Chase with five Ks, and more importantly, no walks. Nothing and two. It's a high chopper to the shortstop. Harrison feels it from the second base back and throws to first. One down. Sign from Graham, and here comes the 2-2 pitch. Swing and a miss, strike three. So his first strike out of the game, 23rd of the season. He's got a better than two to one strikeout to walk ratio. And of course the gym at Bryan County that had everybody talking because he threw seven innings on 63 pitches, nine pitches per inning. There's a one, two hopper over to Brock Harrison at short. His throw to first base is perfect. And that's another three up and three down for Chase Musselman in the dog defense. 2-2. Two, two. Swing and a missed strike three. Two down. Chase's 2-2. Two, two. Hit on the ground to Harrison. Several hops and he handles it and throws to first. And that's two down. Second pitch. Hit on the ground. Brock Harrison moves to his left. Feels it near the second base bag. Throws to first. And that's a three up and three down, and we'll continue about the Bulldog soccer team. Omar made a nice pass. Julian, swing, and a missed strike three. And he and Martin were real stoppers there on the back line. There's a called strike three. Back-to-back -back strikeouts from Musselman to open up the fifth inning. And a very fast ball game that started a little bit after six. So we have yet to play an hour. Nothing and two. Popped up in the air right side. Will it hang up long enough? Yet Chase Miller is able to basket catch it from his first base position and foul territory. And that is out number three. Two Ks and that little pop-up. And now we're headed to the bottom of the fifth inning. Going all the way back to 1999. Swing and a miss at the 0-2 strike three. Batters played some teams tough. They came in at 4-10 and 10 and 0-7 and in the region. Ball's hit right side. Dalton Lynn, the second baseman, scoops it and underhand throws it over to Chase Miller for out number three. That's 3-1. Three and one. Here's the pitch to Musselman. Swing and a miss. The count is full. Now the dogs are down to their final strike. Down by that one run. They've been down by that same run since the end of the top of the third. 
3-2 to Chase. Pops it up in the air. Rigdon, the shortstop, going out into the grass, but it drops in for a base hit. Wow. Two out hit on a 3-2 pitch by Musselman as he looped it over the shortstop, and neither the left fielder or center fielder were able to get to it. Chase Musselman winding. One and nothing pitch. One hopper to Brock Harrison at short. Now here's his throw to first base in time. And Chase Musselman ends his fine game, his three-hitter with a three-up and three-down in the bottom of the seventh inning. Is it Musselman most certainly will pitch sometime this week. He went six up and six down the other night against Tattnall in relief. 1-1, one, one, curveballs hit left side of the infield. Should be a tough play. Scooped up by the third baseman, Kirkland throws to first. The ball gets away. Brock Harrison breaks to the dish and scores, and the Dogs have runners on first and third. You might score that a hit, and then, of course, the error would allow the run to score. I don't think they had a chance to get Musselman. Livingston comes to the plate. Musselman bunts it. Livingston picks it up with a bare hand, throws to first base, and high and chases safe. That'll be an infield hit anyway. He had beaten it out with his speed running down the first baseline. Thomas is a right-hander. And his first pitch to Musselman, and he bunts it third base side. This is a dandy. Musselman runs hard down that first base line. No throw from Kirkland, and he's on with the infield hit again. That was Cox who was playing that position yesterday. He's pitching today. There's a bunt third base side to Riley Powers from the line. He throws to first base, and Chase is safe. He beat it out. And field hit for the Bulldogs with two down. Chase with his 19th hit. Now hitting over 300 because he came into the game hitting 300 on the button. Brock looks back towards second. Here's his pitch. Hit on the ground of the shortstop. Chase Musselman feels it cleanly. Throws to second to Dalton Lynn for the out. And the Bulldogs do get out of the jam. Effective pitching by Brock Harrison. Sixth three-hit game of the season. There's a high chopper to Landry Mead. Waits on it, and now guns to first base, and Chase has beat it out again. Another infield hit for Chase Musselman. He did that in the second. He does it in the fourth. First baseman, second baseman, Dalton Lynn playing shallow on the right side. Grounder to Chase Musselman. Feels it. Looks the runner back at third. Throws to first. And he got the out effective play there, keeping that runner from scoring and getting the out on a good throw.